So right here I have the garden tower and I'm going to assemble it and what it is is a tower, compact tower that you can grow up to 50 little plants and I plan on putting some strawberries. The other nice feature about this is that you can put food scraps in the middle of it and the plants will eat it and so I put it here on my deck where it's close to the kitchen so we can just easily put food scraps in it. So let's get started. So I don't quite have enough dirt to fill this up, but I'm eager to get some plants in there. So I'm gonna go ahead and plant uh, the strawberries that I have. So the instructions say that to fill it up about a third of the way with soil, and then add approximately three gallons of water to the soil that's there. And I'll just circle this, try to evenly rotate it. So I've given the water a chance to percolate down. Now I'm going to get these uh, strawberries out. Now these are Pineberry White Carolina strawberries and then there's some red ones in here as well to help with the pollination. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and get these out. I ended up repurposing some old feed bags in order to fill up with some topsoil from the high tunnel project. I'm going to try to fill it up the rest of the way. idea is that over time this water and stuff will come down here would be the uh, nutrient tea so then you can take this bring it back up here pour it back in there so I'll go ahead and let it go let it get situated before I plant anything else in the top but uh, I'm really thrilled to try this out now I these are available on farmerbread.com and I purchased this one with my own money because uh, I wanted to be able to try it out firsthand and so uh, these two rows are going to be strawberries and what I like about this is that you can rotate it around and uh, so 
if you have like a small amount of space, you got 50 opportunities to grow something, which I think is incredible. Now they do offer an upgrade kit where you can get coaster or uh, wheels uh, for the three legs. That way it can be moved around a little bit, but uh, I have it on my deck so that's close to the kitchen so we can put food scraps in there. And this way is south facing so it should get plenty of sun throughout the day no matter which side the plants are on. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and make sure to get your The Garden Tower Project to on FarmerBrad.com.